According to information published by General Dynamics Land Systems on October 8, 2022, GDLS presents the next-generation American-made main battle tank, MBT, with its Abrams X Technology Demonstrator. The General Dynamics Land Systems Abrams X Technology Demonstrator will be unveiled during the ASA 2022 Association of United States Army Defense Exhibition that will take place in Washington, D.C. from 10 to the 12th of October 2022. With the Abrams X, GDLS demonstrated its ability to develop a new generation of main battle tank offering more firepower, protection and mobility able to counter all the new threats of the modern battlefield. As the next generation of main battle tank, the Abrams X technology demonstrator features reduced weight for improved mobility and transportability, delivering the same tactical range as the M1A2 Abrams with 50% less fuel consumption. The Abrams X's hybrid power pack supports the U.S. Army's climate and electrification strategies, enhances silent watch capability and even allows for some silent mobility. With a reduced crew size and AI-enabled lethality, survivability, mobility, manned, unmanned teaming, MUM-T, and autonomous capabilities, Abrams X can be a key node in lethal battlefield networks and serve as a bridge from Abrams SEPV-3 and SEPV-4 to future tank. The Abrams X is completely based on a new design compared to the M1A2 Abrams tank family. In terms of protection, the Abrams X is fitted with a new armor package mounted on the hull and the turret. The tank also integrates an APS, active protection system, able to intercept anti-tank guided missiles and other current projectiles by launching a small warhead and initiating it at a safe distance from the protected platform, at a precisely calculated moment, and defeating or destructing the threat through a shock wave effect. The firepower of the Abrams X is also strengthened using a new generation of 120mm main gun able to fire new ammunition MRM, mid-range munitions, AMP, advanced multi-purpose, and AIC, advanced kinetic energy. A coaxial machine gun is mounted on the right of the main armament and a remotely operated weapon station is mounted on the turret roof which is armed with 130mm automatic cannon and one machine gun. According to GDLS, the Abrams X will function as a key node in lethal battlefield networks, and serve as a bridge between the currently fielded Abrams SCPV-3 and the recently unveiled SCPV-4 iteration to some sort of future tank, whatever that might look like. When soldiers can expect to get their hands on the Abrams X remains to be seen. The service only received its first half-dozen initial production versions of the SCPV-3 back in October 2017 and started testing the SCPV-4 this year.